that's one of our that's one of our thrusts, clarifying the entire process there. The second so my role yesterday was to present the involvement of PADCD in the development of the blockchain industry in the country as we represent one of the largest networks of the centralized industries and blockchain companies and fintech companies. I mentioned how we were working with various government agencies with regards to the regulation of fintech, of blockchain, of cryptocurrencies in the country, as well as the progress of international involvement within the country. In the Philippines, as well as Southeast Asia, we are seeing a continuous crackdown on blockchain technologies, inclusive of cryptocurrency. This in turn has led companies to both shy away and to seize development of solutions that could potentially impact the lives of more than 200 million unbanked individuals around the Southeast Asian region. Now, PADCD hopes that by involving government, regulators, private industry, stakeholders in international associations, and private individuals in coming up with policies, regulations, and guidelines that streamline the process of operating companies in this particular field. We hope to both protect consumers, assure governments that regulation is possible, and make sure that industry representatives follow best practices to ensure protection on both the consumer, government, and corporate side of things. We see events such as IMTC as being a means to not only introduce, but also to explain further and to dispel myths and misconceptions about technology's involvement in these long-lasting um, industries, such as the remittance business. Without such an event, we would see a lot more fear, uncertainty, and doubt that could potentially in hamper the adoption of the, this kind of technology within the Southeast Asian region and potentially even the world. So we were, we were actually thankful that we were given this chance to interact with the community, with the industry in this event.